we have some hundred million people under wind chill warnings and yes. advisories, but yet we're breaking heat records exactly. here. Exactly. Yeah. Crazy. Mean, Extreme weather on both sides. Exactly. And usually, you know, when one side sees, sees cold, one side sees heat, but not to this extent. I mean, we're talking record breakers, as Jeff just mentioned, 85 today. Mm. That yeah. was a forecast high, probably mm. one of the warmest numbers in the entire country. Really? I'll have to double check that, but I, I would put money on it. And then we've got 10 degree temperatures, one degree temperatures, 19 degrees in New York. I mean, freezing. Did you see yeah. the freezing folks on cold. New Year's Eve? It oh was, my gosh. Oh, I felt no. so it bad like for them. Five. Oh my they goodness. They were all just. With all the bundles Bundle. and layers, yeah. yeah. And you know, and you guys know, being out in the field, when it's cold, it's uh, hard to talk. It's hard to, you're, everything it's freezes. Like freezes, <laughs> yeah, and you're trying to get the words out, but you can't. <laughs> yeah. And that happens here in Southern California when yes. you're out, you know, reporting when it's in the uh, 40s, yes, yep. 50s, 30s. Talk about yeah. 10. Oh or my God, below. I can't imagine. It's right. tough. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> We've all been there. <laughs> Yeah, we have. <laughs> oh my goodness, you guys. But now we're just enjoying mild temperatures here in Southern California. And maybe some changes. By changes, we could see some rain. Something that we need rain and snow. So we're going to be talking about that in just a minute. But first, we are taking you outside right now. Numbers mostly in the 60s and 50s, 59 downtown as we head to Santa Ana, 63, 68 in Riverside. And as we get a look at temperatures across the country, we we're just talking about this. Take a look. Grand Forks, one degree. Chicago, six degrees. New York, 19. And Boston, 17 degrees. So freezing cold for you. And we're taking a look. We've got record heat from earlier today. So shifting gears from from one degree to 85 degrees. That was the record high, forecast high for Woodland Hills, Lancaster, 70 degrees earlier today. And as we get a look right here, your future cast showing you chance of showers moving in. As we head to Fraser Park, you're going to see maybe a few showers. It doesn't look like it's going to drop further north than Ventura County, but we could see a few stray showers Wednesday into your Thursday. But it looks like everything's stopping short of Santa Barbara County and Ventura County. There is another chance on the way, possibly next week, but at this point, Again, maybe a shower, a little cloudier, a little cooler. Temperatures earlier today, 78 in downtown, with average being 68 degrees. So we were above average by 10 degrees. By tomorrow, we're expecting 70s and 80s, still warm, but we could see rain to our north and more cloud cover for most of us. You'll see 72 Anaheim, 66 as we head to Huntington Beach, and as we head to the Inland Empire, you'll see temperatures in the 70s and the 80s, 78 in Riverside, Menifee 77, and Paris at 77 degrees as well. So a very warm forecast for us now, but we are expecting changes on the way as we get a look at my seven day microclimate forecast right here for the beaches, the basin and the valleys. You'll see temperatures in the 70s for the next few days and the 60s increasing cloud cover. And by the weekend, a slight chance of rain Sunday into Monday. But at this point, looks like most of it will stay to our north. As we check in with one more seven day for the IE high desert and mountains, same thing goes, more widespread cloud cover, slightly cooler temperatures, but even then we're still eyeing 70s for the IE, 60s for the high desert and 50s for the mountains. Back to you guys.